Hello students, welcome to Chemistry Concept and today we are going to learn how to write a formula of some, of some ionic salts. Let's say we start with aluminium sulfate. Okay, if you want to write the formula of aluminium sulfate, there, there are two part of any salt. First is cation, second is anion. So if I, if I want to write the name of alu, formula of aluminium sulfate, I must know that what is the formula of aluminium cation and sulfate anion. Okay, aluminium is Al3 positive and sulfate ion is SO4 to negative. Fine. Next step which we have to do that valencies need to be exchanged. Okay, 2 will go to aluminium and 3 will go to sulfate giving the formula. Al2 SO4 whole thrice aluminium sulfate. Similarly, if we want to write the formula of potassium carbonate, potassium is K positive, carbonate is CO3 to negative. All these things I have to learn. Okay, so now plus means it's plus 1, 1 goes to carbonate ion, 2 comes to potassium. So the formula is K2CO3. Similar is the concept with magnesium phosphate. Magnesium is Mg positive phosphate is PO43 negative. Okay, so again the same thing plus 1 that is 1 goes to phosphate ion, 3 goes to magnesium, and the formula is Mg3. Okay, let me correct myself. Magnesium here is plus. 2 actually okay it's 2 plus so 2 goes to phosphate 1 comes to magnesium and the formula is sorry 3 comes to magnesium and the formula is mg3 po4 twice magnesium phosphate okay now let's try to write the name of the formula of Potassium dichromate. Okay. Again, potassium is K positive. Dichromate is Cr2O7 to negative. So again, the charges or the valencies are exchanged. Potassium 1 goes to chromate. 2 comes to potassium. And the formula is K2 Cr2. O seven. So one thing is clear that if I want to understand or learn how to write the formula of any ionic compound, I must know that what are uh, the, the symbols for ions, how to represent an ion. For example, if I want to write ammonium uh, sulfate, I must know that ammonium ion is NH4 positive and sulfate is SO4 to negative now now next is easy just exchange the valencies so and it becomes n h 4 whole twice so 4 hope uh, i hope these things were clear to you stay tuned uh, for more videos of organic inorganic and physical chemistry thank you